Good morning, Hot Tots. Welcome back to my channel. <laughs> my hand. So I woke up at 7 a.m. I've realized now that I get less flustered with working if I wake up about an hour or a half an hour before I need to start work, get my coffee, kind of have moment to hatch, if you will. I used to be someone who's just go, go, go in the morning, like let's go, but now I just need this like hatching time to relax, have my mind slowly wake up and go. I'm using my Nespresso machine. I used one of the pods. They give you like a starter kit of pods. And so far I've been trying the different coffee ones because I don't have anything to add to my espresso pods. So I need to go to the store and get like milk and more creamer. I ran out of creamer. So I just added some like whipped cream to this. That's all. Um, but yeah, so I'm just having my coffee. I love my Nespresso machine. I'll do like a little review on it and everything once I've used it enough to know and have, you know, tried different pods and everything like that. But I'm really loving it and the taste is so much better. The caffeine in it is so much more intense. <laughs> I'm like, whoa! But this morning has been crazy. I have three minutes before my next meeting. I've had meeting after meeting since 8 a.m., and I had one, two, three, four meetings so far, and I have two more in a row after that. And then finally by noon, I'll have a break. So depending if this coffee is still kicked in, I'm gonna work out probably at lunchtime. And then this afternoon I have one, two, three, four, five meetings. So today is filled with meetings and it's just been crazy, but I just wanted to say hello, good morning, and I'll see you guys at lunch. Okay, you guys know I don't usually eat breakfast, but I'm gonna have one of these hash browns. My stomach just feels like really like butterfly-y because I'm not used to the amount of caffeine um, that I just drank from that one coffee and it's just like making my stomach kind of feel sick. So I'm gonna have a hash brown, and put it in the air fryer. I got these from Trader Joe's and I've never tried one before. So I'm just gonna place one into the air fryer it's four points for one. They're pretty decent size. So I'm just gonna eat that. Place in the air fryer at 400 degrees for five minutes or so and eat that with a little bit of ketchup to just like have something in my stomach because I feel like anxiety. This is what happens when I have a lot, like more caffeine than usual, which honestly, I do drink pop a lot, but like my coffees are so weak. So my body's not even used to a real coffee. <laughs> Okay, so here's what I'm gonna have for breakfast. And I just am counting one point's worth of ketchup with four points worth of hash brown. So I'm just gonna eat this and see if it kind of makes me feel a little better. I just feel a little like off, a little fluttery and a little nauseous from my coffee. <laughs> my body is not used to it, so this is it. Okay, so work is crazy right now. So I'm gonna wait till after work to work out. Um, so. Don't mind my dirty oven. I'm going to make one of these Johnsonville apple chicken sausages. It is four points per sausage, so I'm gonna make one of those. I'm heating up my skillet now. I'm just toasting one piece of the Sara Lee's 45 calorie bread. I'm gonna spray it with this zero point, I can't believe it's not butter, spray butter. I'm gonna do five tablespoons of egg white so that it's zero points. And then I have another hash brown being made in the air fryer right now. So with the hash brown being four points, this being four points, and this being one point, it will be a nine point lunch. Um, and I'm just having like a little breakfast for lunch because I really love that hash brown this morning and then it just got me really wanting breakfast food. So Oliver is trying to get more snacks. And someone already had snacks today and has put his food all over here. He likes to carry his food away from his bowl, huh, thinkers? Yes. So that's gonna be lunch. Okay, don't mind the dirty plate. This is my lunch or my breakfast plate, but I just added a little bit of ketchup and that would make this 10 points. So it's a 10 point lunch when you add the ketchup. And Sometimes I don't add the ketchup points, sometimes I do, it just depends. Lately I've had extra points at the end of the day and I wanna kinda of be more on track, so I did track it. Um, so yeah, 10 point lunch and I'm excited. You guys, my day job is so busy right now, it's crazy. So me, I'm gonna look like this, so like crap, until 
this evening because I was going to do the Peloton. I didn't have time at lunch. I have five minutes before my next meeting. I literally only have an hour, full a full hour throughout the day of no meeting time to get all this other stuff done. So I am going walking with my friend Dana after work and then I'll take a shower and like look a little more presentable. But I'm already hungry. Like I'm so hungry today. It's 2.21. I ate it around noon. I might go get a snack because I'm already hungry. Oh man, I'm stressed. My day job is getting stressful. Okay, so I just got done with work. I'll probably have to work more tonight, but I am going on a long walk with Dana. Anyways, I will let you guys know after I go on my walk. Um, me and Dana have a ton to catch up on. So we're gonna walk and then I'll let you guys know how many miles we walked because she has her watch on. Of course, I forgot mine again. But I'll let you know how that all goes and then we'll go home and make some dinner. I didn't end up eating a snack. I was going to, but my job, oh my gosh, it is crazy right now, which makes me feel good because I feel job security with that. But then obviously anything could happen, but anything could happen to anybody, you know, what's meant to be will be. Okay, I'll see you guys when I get done walking Whoa, you guys I'm so cold so we ended up walking like uh four miles and some change and I just got back I'm obviously frozen my hands are cold and I'm making this so one can of this Campbell's well yes tomato and sweet basil soup is seven points and then I'm making two pieces like a Velveeta cheese um grilled cheese. It's two pieces of Sara Lee's uh, 45 calorie bread and then two pieces of Velveeta cheese. And then I just used the zero point spray butter. So all together, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, it's 11 points. Yeah. 11 point dinner, I believe. And that's what we're having. It's going to be delicious. And then I'll still have some points left. I forget how many. So either we'll do a dessert or another snack. Look at this guy. That's from my freaking Nespresso. They had three boxes in within each other for it. I'm like, was this necessary? <laughs> Lately, guys, I've been braiding my hair and then putting them in like little buns. <laughs> I love it. I don't know why. Anyways, so I will show you guys my soup and my sandwich when I'm done because I know you're just dying to visually see my soup and Sam which I'm just putting this guy in the microwave and I ran out of paper towels didn't think that through need to go to the store and get some but I'm just put a little towel over it but all right I'll show you it when it's done Ugh. I'm also having some DC cola which I call Diet Coke, DC Cola. I don't know why. I made it up one day. I'm sure someone else in the world calls it that too. But I love it. But I like it. But I like it. Oh, I can feel my face when I'm with you. <laughs> but I love it. But I love it. Oh, I can feel my face. Thank you. He doesn't go all the way in, but he gives me like almost a kiss. I love you. I'm literally putting my hands over this heater or over the, it's not a heater. It's a uh, oven burner because I'm so cold. <laughs> oh no, my towel got into the soup. Whoopsie daisies. So I'm sitting at my um, island and I'm going to watch TV right there. And I've been watching Good Girls. I freaking love it, you guys. Annie on Good Girls kills me. I freaking love her. And she reminds me so much of my cousin Chrissy. She's so funny and so quick and so like vulgar and hilarious. I love it. So I'm gonna watch Good Girls and eat this. And then I'll see you guys after. Okay, for dessert, 
Are we shocked that I'm going to be using Funfetti icing? No. For two tablespoons, it's 140 calories and it's seven points. I'm just doing one tablespoon. I'm just craving actual icing. So I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna do a bowl of grapes and an uh, apple. And that's what we're doing. So I'll have this and I'll either eat it separate or dip my apple and grapes in it. And then I'll just have grapes and apples. I have one of these sweet apple cutters that I just whoop, love so much. I'm just gonna place those in the bowl and then we're going to weigh out the Funfetti dip. It says one tablespoon, so two tablespoons is 34 grams. So we'll take half of that and weigh that out. Okay, so we're going to zero this out and take out 17 grams, which is what equals one serving. Okay. So what I'll probably do is just take that little bit and that's gonna be it. And I know it's so sad, but that's what we gotta do, people. And then we're going to just eat some grapes. I already cleaned these all off. We're just gonna add some of these to our little dish and call it a night. And there, my friends, is dessert. Oh, and how could I forget sprinkles? Because sprinkles make everything more fun. So I am done eating for the night and that's it for today's video, you guys. Thank you so, so much for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe if you haven't, because it really helps support my channel. I post every Monday and Thursday and sometimes on a random mother day. I love you guys so much. Peace out, Brussels sprouts.